Hello everybody, welcome to an episode of Scratch Cards from the National Lottery. So today I've got £35 worth of Scratch Cards for you. I only planned to get £20 worth today. I was going to do some of the latest Scratch Cards from the National Lottery today, which I am doing, but I've found even more new Scratch Cards, so I've had to get those as well. So £15 more than I planned to spend today. But it's got to be done. So, what have I got for you? Well, three of the Black Pearl scratch cards. So, I was only going to originally get three of these and do five of these 100,000s in teal. I've only got four of them to do today, though. So, well, on camera anyway, I've only got four of the traditional 100,000s in teal. Uh, but then I found these new ones as well, so I had to get them. Uh, a Cube Smash. Two of the Triple Cash Words. A Lucky Bonus. And to get it up to the £35 worth today, a couple of the £1 Blazing Seven. So the latest scratch cards from the National Lottery today, the newest of the lot... Let's see if they can bring me some luck, shall we? Let's do this. Let's pick them all back up. Um, and let's hope for the best. Uh, which order shall I do them in? That's the way. That's why there's three of these black pearls and not two of each of the five pound scratch cards. Um, right. Let's have a look then. Let's see if the new scratch cards can do anything for me today. If anything... At all, so on this Blazing 7 scratch card, match three identical symbols in a vertical, horizontal or diagonal line to win the prize for that line. Exactly identical to the Gem Smash scratch card. The only difference is that column is now worth £4 instead of £5. Haven't got a clue why they've decided to do that. Not that I'm a fan of this style of scratch card anyway. Well, let's have a look. Let's zoom in a tad. And let's uh, hope for the best. So we've got sevens and flames. Okie dokie. So now, 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 now. So nothing on the first. On to the second of these then. Oh, he's done exactly the same. Oh, we've got three flames across the bottom. Two pound win. Very nice. Okay. We have a winner. We are not going to bust today on these scratch cards. Three flames across the bottom. Two pound prize. Very nice. Right, let's see if these 100,000s in teal can do anything as well. I do like this uh, better than the red one. Nice, simple, single game to play. You've got just as much chance of winning on a single game with a bonus as you have with 10 games. So let's take a look. Match three identical prize amounts to win that amount. or And find the crossed fingers in the bonus game. To win that prize. So let's take a look. Oh, 200,000s. Okie dokie, we got 200,000s, 250s, two ones. A 10, a 10,000 and a 5, so nothing there. Oh, but we have got a set of crossed fingers in the bonus. And they are worth £2. Very nice. I'm happy. At least one of the four scratch cards has won. Brilliant stuff. Right, so we got £2 on that one. Because all four of these could be losers. Especially as they are one pound scratch card so to get a win is a uh, happy days let's uh continue then oh look at these two ten thousands two 
two twos. Okie dokie, two ten thousands, two twos, two ones, a one hundred, a one thousand, and a twenty. A gem in the bonus, so nothing on the second. Moving on to the third then. Can we be third time lucky? Well, we were first time lucky on this one, so I'll let you off. Two twos again. Oh, and there's a third. We are third time lucky as well. Fantastic. I don't think you can win four pounds on this edition, so you won't get the crossed fingers as well. But very nice. We had the crossed fingers for two pounds. Now we've got a match three to win. Two, two, two for another two pounds. That's money back for these hundred thousands as well. So if we have got a diabolical result today, the one pound scratch cards are not responsible. Brilliant stuff. Let's head on to the final of these teal hundred thousands then. Oh, look at that. Two fives. Right off the mark. That's a crown. I saw that crown sticking out. Right, two fives, two tens, two thousands, two fifties, and a hundred thousand. So nothing on the final hundred thousand today, but happy days. All my money back for the one pound cards. So yeah, can't complain with them. Let's move straight up to the three pound scratch cards now. Zooming out a tad for these, of course. Lucky bonus. So on this particular game, in a game, match the winning symbol, 20 of my symbols to win the prize. Find one or more horseshoe symbols in any of these four games to win the prize shown in the lucky prize table. So the more horseshoes we find, the better. And in the bonus game, find a lucky hat to win the prize. So the winning symbol on this one today is some gold. So we're looking for gold bars and, of course, horseshoes. Oh, we've got a winner. There's a gold bar. Fantastic. Okie dokie, we didn't find any horseshoes as well, but we have got a winner there. No hat in the bonus game. It's a bike. How much of a one? A fiver. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Brilliant stuff. Gold, gold. Fantastic. Five quid. Right, moving on then to the triple cash words now in pink. This is an unusual one. I did mention this in my live episode. The bonus game, we need to find the crossed fingers to win a fiver. Not too keen on it being that low, but another thing about this triple cash word card is there are more £5 prizes than there are £3 prizes. So make of that what you will. A fiver is definitely better than three quid. So more five pound prizes than three pound prizes. There isn't a ten pound prize on this game, um, and there isn't a six pound prize either. I don't think. Now there isn't. It goes straight from five to nine, probably because of the triple element to the card. So there isn't a ten pound prize. It jumps up to fifteen again. I'm happy with that, I suppose. It's nice to see a few random prize amounts. So on this game, you know how it works. Three or more words completed on this word grid wins a prize. The more words completed, the more I win. If I win and one of the words completed contains a circled letter, then I triple my prize. So that would be nice to see as well. So triple cash words in pink. Two of them to do. Let's start with the first. So the letter, the first letter out on this one is a V. Back to the usual style cash word now. Um, yes, are there any Vs? 
Yes, there are. I'm skipping right past them. I'm not used to this style now. I've got to get back into it. V. V, V, V. Right. D. Okie dokie. S. M. H Now on the old edition of this triple cash word All of the circled letters used to come out all the time Will that be the case this time as well? Well, we'll find out as this card goes along, won't we? H, any more H's? I don't see any R The circled letter as well. Nice to see a few R's about today. Very nice. You. I. L Y P Don't see any P's. B. K. Now K's. G. Couple of G's there. J, not looking very good, is it, this one? <laughs> e, that does complete one word, egg. I think we needed the E, didn't we? That completes a second word there as well, I. I just can't believe it, you've got more chance of winning a fiver than you have three pounds on this card. And I bet you I'll still win £3 more than I'll win a fiver. But hey-ho, we'll see. Lots of ease about, which is very good. Um, I think that's all of the ease. Two words are now completed. A T would give us a win. Um, yeah, I think that's the only letter at present. Two more letters to go. C is the first of them. I wonder if N will be the final letter because it's in a circle. Yes, it is. There you go, then. Oh, we've got three words. Den. There we go. We've got a winner, then. It looks, uh, looks as though we've got a three-pound win. 
Um, one of the least, less common prizes, apparently, on this card. Well, it is because there are more fivers than there are threes. And I seem to have found a three. So I must be lucky at to have found a three-pound win. <laughs> How about that? That's very bizarre, isn't it? Very bizarre. But there you go. Egg. Two uh, Gs. E. Double G. I. E. Y. E. And then D. E N. That is three words completed. You can't get eight quid, so there's no crossed fingers hiding there. So yeah, it looks as though it is a three pound winner. Let me just quickly glance over it. Eyes, there's a H of mist. I knew I would on the first one. It's been so long. O's, R's, W's. There's another N. D -d -d -d, I think that's it then. Right, three pounds it is. I'll take it. Absolutely right. Let's head on to the second of these cash words. Let's see if anything happens. Are you to kick us off this time? Okie dokie. L. Just the one in the circle, it seems. I. Okie dokie, that's all the A's. T. We could do with that E again, couldn't we? Oh dear, there's a Z. We haven't had a dreaded Q yet, have we? Z. And I don't want a Q either. Z. Don't see any Zs. D. V. There's a V. Oh, and there's a V. An E would now give us a triple win. If an E did a show its face. N. Come on then, E. Don't mess me about. <laughs> I don't think it'll happen because we've just had a £3 win. But you can uh, definitely go get more than one win in a row. Absolutely. Quite a few ends about, very nice. Have I missed any ends? Um, I think that's all the ends, right. H. K. W. F. So yes, it looks like all the letters in circles do come out on this edition as well, but that's all of the circled letters that have come out. Once again, any more Fs? 
I don't see any. I. Okie dokie. There's another W. M. That completes one word there. Mind. S. Completes a second word there. Ask. And a third word. We've got two winners in a row. Brilliant. I love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> Come on then, E. Do it for me. Two £3 wins in a row. Less £3 prizes than um, fivers. Don't do it to me. <laughs> right, uh, so let's just confirm that then. Mind, M-I-N-D. Sand, S. A N D ask A S K. Fantastic. I love it. Absolutely love it. Um, any more S's? Right. G. Just the one G. And I would take an O. That would give us a tripler as well. Uh, G, G, G. B, kind of ruin the last letter. And R. Right. It looks as though it is just the two £3 wins in a row. How about that? Lots of R's about. Left with uh, E's and O's, I see. Don't think C came out. Um, and again, you can't get the crossed fingers with a £3 win. So uh, there's that one out of the way. Uh, let's quickly check again. C-E-O. Them are the only three letters left. C-E and O. Now that's it then. Ask, mind, sand. Just the three words once again for another £3. How about that? Right, I'll take it though, absolutely, onto the £5 scratch cards now, let's hope it keeps it up. Again, the £3 cards, very good indeed, all money back, bit of profit I think on the three the three pound cards. So it's all down to the £5ers to keep us on form today, cube smash to kick us off, a bit like full of 1000, the only difference is we have to get two identical symbols in a game rather than the crossed fingers to win the prize. Two double symbols wins double the prize. So let's take a look at Cube Smash. Can we smash it? Well, it doesn't look good so far, does it? Lots of gold bars about. Yep, nothing on the Cube Smash scratch card today. So not off to the best of starts with the five pounders. Um, yeah, nothing on Cube Smash. Right, we've got three of these Black Pearl scratch cards all in a row to do now. So I hope at least one of these gives me a win. Oh, it's not guaranteed, of course. Um, prizes go from £15 up to £25. So there isn't a £20 prize on this card. Probably a good thing. There is a black pearl symbol on this main game here. Find a black pearl to win five times the prize shown. So I'd like to see that at some point. Um, other than that, it's just a usual number match game. Match any of the winning numbers, 20 of my numbers to win the prize. Two little games at the bottom. In a row, if my pearls weigh more than their pearls, win the prize in game two. And in the third and final game, in a row, match two identical symbols to win the prize. So, three of these to do now. Let's hope for the best. 
preferably a black pearl symbol. 33, 24, 40, 18 and 34. I'm not used to this many winning numbers either. We haven't had that for a long time on a £5 scratch card either, have we? So I uh, need to keep my wits about me. We haven't got any single numbers. 23, you've got 24. Oh, look, here's the single numbers that we don't want. 35, 33 and 34. 34. Oh, we've got a 34. We've got a winner. 19. 32. So we have got a winner with a 34. Let's see if my pearls weigh more than theirs. 26, 28, 18, 25, so nothing there. Two identical symbols. Now, I'm going to come back to that 34 at the end, just in case it's the only winner out of these three Black Pearl scratch cards. But at least we've got a win on one of them. Thank God for that. Right, on to the second of these black pearls then. I'm going to do my numbers first this time, just to see if I can uncover any duplicates, because duplicates do happen quite a lot on this card, I've noticed. Um, all black pearls. Any black pearls about? So I'm scratching my numbers off first on this one. Okie dokie, I don't see any duplicate numbers. Let's see if any of the numbers match. No black pearls either. 32 is the first of the winning numbers. Got 31 and 30. Now 32. Number 20, I definitely don't remember seeing a 20. Number 12. 22 and number 2. Number 11. And number 6. 8 and 7, but now 6 is, and so nothing there. 25, 28. 15, 24. And now matches, so nothing on the second of these Black Pearl scratch cards. Will we get anything on the final Black Pearl scratch card? Just quickly glancing over this again. Just hoping, really. <laughs> um, I don't see any matches. Right, on to the final scratch card then. Black Pearl, the winning numbers this time are... 35, 13, 33... 30, lots of 30s, and 16. Okay, teens and 30s. Or a black pearl would be nice. Let's hope for the best. Can the last scratch card count? Of course, 14 and 15 are going to come out. 31. Thirty-four again, but we've got thirty-three and thirty-five this time. Thirty-nine, no. No, I don't think it's gonna do it. I should have just bought the one black pearl, shouldn't I? It seems. Thirty-nine, 
There you go. It just goes to show you. I only need to buy the one scratch card. You don't need to buy lots. Right. Black Pearl then. Just the one win. There's no £20 win. And that's what I could do with to cover the £5 scratch cards. Um, I reckon it's just going to be a fiver, you know. Could be £2 million. It's the only way you're going to win £2 million on this card is by getting one win. It's not going to be £2 million. It's just a fiver. So the £5 scratch cards did indeed let me down today. £1 cards and £3 cards got all their money back. Five, £5 cards are £15 short. And that's the reason for the not-so-good result today, actually. We've had a few winning scratch cards, though. Can't say we haven't had many of those today. So out of the £35 that I spent, I got back five. Um... 10, 16, 18, 20, 22 pounds. So, yeah, that's quite a respectable sum, actually, a respectable result. It could have been a lot worse than that. It has been a lot worse than that, to be fair, in the past. Um, but, yes, it could have been better as well. Definitely the £5 scratch cards let us down today. Otherwise, it would have been a very, very... Good result. Lots of winning scratch cards in there today. Two triple cash word. Three pound wins in a row. And there are more five pound wins. That's very bizarre. Um, uh, yeah, just a fiver on the Black Pearl. But at least one of those three did win. So, yes, I can be thankful for that. £22 back out of the £35 spent. Unlucky for some today. £13 down. But that doesn't matter. I've made an episode for you. I'll get that money back easily. See, yes, thank you so, so much for your support. Any likes, subscribes and comments are always much appreciated. I've showed you some of the newest scratch cards from the National Lottery as well today. And at least there were quite a lot of winners amongst them. So, yeah, there you go. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you again very, very soon in the run-up to episode number 400. See you then. Goodbye.